Hi, good morning, my dear students. Already last class we have discussed about the continuity. What do you mean by continuity? Suppose f is a real function, subset of real number, and c be the domain, c be a point in a domain, and limit extends to c, f of x is equal to f of c is called the continuity. So look at the question first. How they are asking question? So let us discuss one by one. Discuss the continuity of the cosine, cosine, second, and cotangent functions. Four trigonometric functions are there. Only they are not asking for the two. Twos are ever common. Let us discuss one by one. First one, I am going to take a solution given. So f of x is equal to cosine function. What do you mean by cosine? I hope you know that expression f of x is equal to cos x. For all x belongs to R. Right? That just a very common thing. So look at this one. Apply for the limit. X tends to A. A means what? Arbitrary value. Right? I am not going to take constant. One of the arbitrary. It means that value is continuous. So limit extends to f of x. So here apply limit extends to a cos x. So this is cos a. Therefore f of a is equal to cos a. So here that the cos function f of x is equal to cos x is continuous at all the point point of x belongs to R. Hence, a f is continuous function. Clear everyone? I am going to define. This is the one R two marks question. So second one. What is the second one? Solution given. So f of x is equal to cos second function. Alright? So f of x is equal to what is the value? Cos function. Alright? This is the function. It has plus positive to do trigonometric form. Look at this one. But here the conditions are there. Shall I take f of x is equal to 1 by sin x? In the conditions of, in the conditions of, so when you are going to take that x is equal to, it means theta, it expressed for the value. So here n pi or 2n pi, n pi. So n pi means what? So when you are going to take so n is equal to 0, 1, 2, 3, 4. So theta will be, x will be 0. Hence in this except all these points, except, except, except of n pi, all the points of x belongs to R. Therefore, the function, the, the function f of x is continuous at the point of x belongs to r. Hence, we prove that. So, you are going to define for the third one also. What is the third one? Here I am f of x is equal to second function, right? Second, so f of x is equal to, what is the value? Sec, right? Sec x or sec theta. This is the form of function. I can express in the form of trigonometric form. So when we are going to take f of x is equal to 1 by cos x, right? Why do you take 1 by cos x? Because cos x value is a 0. 
so then only consider here x is equal to so what you can consider 2n 2n plus 1 pi pi 2 right check it this one so when we are going to take some values then theta r x or what is the cos 0 1 cos 90 it is a 0 so that expression I am going to consider in that point for r x belongs to r therefore except therefore the except point which point so x is equal to 2n plus 1 pi by 2 their other points are it means all the points which point f of x is continuous at the point of x belongs to r except this point right in that r value does not consider so these are the most important problems they are asking two or three marks question so next i'm going to discuss another one is the cotangent uh, otherwise you can do that you are common f of x is equal to for theta cotangent function is that so you can express for the in the trigonometric form and when they are going to take a zero that base so then only you can consider the similar things are there so these type of problems asking for the in your C. Thank you so much. I will continue with the another few problems in the next video. Bye. Barco.